Brilliance Audio presents the unabridged recording of Chicken Soup for the Soul, Think Positive, 29 inspirational stories about silver linings, gratitude, and moving forward, by Jack Canfield, Mark Victor Hansen, and Amy Newmark, forward by Deborah Norville, performed by Tanya Eby and Jim Bond. Forward. Change your thoughts and you change your world. Norman Vincent Peale I can't remember how long it's been since I first heard those words. Change your thoughts and you change your world. It's a simple enough phrase, but wow, those words are packed with power. They have been something of a lifelong mantra for me. Change your thoughts and you change your world. When times are tough, when I feel so frustrated by disappointments and not reaching my goals... I repeat those words in my head and make a conscious, almost physical effort to change course, recalibrate, and steer my little ship of self in a fresh, more positive direction. The other day, I was speaking to a group of women in the financial industry, and one woman asked to what I credited my long television career. I had to think for a moment. I have been blessed in the television business. I started working at the CBS station in Atlanta when I was still in college, and interviewed then-President Jimmy Carter on live TV when I was only 19 years old. I don't know which was more exciting, interviewing the president or having ABC's White House correspondent Sam Donaldson asking me afterward what he said. You could have shot me, and my tombstone would have read, She died happy. Even when my career took some unexpected tough turns, I somehow managed to pull myself and my career back together, pick up the pieces, and start over. But what was the secret to my long and still successful career? As I pondered the question, I realized there were probably three qualities that have worked in my favor, and the good news is anyone can develop them. I have an extraordinary capacity for hard work, an insatiable curiosity, and a sometimes ridiculous ability to look on the bright side. All of us can work hard, put in a few more hours at work, and try a bit harder to master a challenge. Contrary to the old saying, curiosity didn't kill the cat or anyone else. Learning new things, exploring topics about which we know nothing, that's what gives life its zest. But finding the bright side? Well, how does one do that when you've lost a job, gotten a dire diagnosis, or seen your personal life shattered? For me, finding the silver lining in life's clouds was... Sample complete. Ready to continue?